Hey guys, this is another episode of Let's Watch Me Play Dragon Age 2. I'm Kitsu and this is Sora and I have to kill this guy again. <laughs> and I'm Sora. <laughs> <laughs> we have a plan of how to introduce the video and you're just crapping all over it. Yep. Oh yeah, she looks like a fight. I really enjoy it when you knock people over. Cool. Like they're just close enough to each other that you can hit the boat. Yep. You almost want to do it in time? Nope. Might as well give one to Al. Hey guard, your boss is dead. Why don't you just leave? Nope. Alright. You'll kill him even if having him get down. Yeah. Yeah, level up. Anyone actually take. Heal? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, what is the difference between leveling up your uh, magic? more than willpower or the other way around. Uh, magic gives you magic power and willpower gives you mana. Okay. So like if you had more sustain and like uh, maybe hexes and stuff that require you to channel, it will be better to get willpower? Yeah, I guess. Eventually when I be more supporty, I'll probably take more in willpower. Because okay. those have a lot of sustain things. really know what I'm taking half the time. I just pick whatever's next in the tree. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it works. Yep. I mean, you've only died like two times. Oh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what? We've I realized something. That if you just keep skipping everything, then that's fine. I yeah. mean, this could just be like a walkthrough and people won't be spoiled it. of what the actual story is. We're here to stay. At least for a Whatever. <laughs> I just skip because I don't want to watch it. I was trying to make you seem more concerning about the viewers. Nope. Don't even start to think that. <laughs> oh, okay, we have to watch this. <laughs> that guy's stare. Alright, so we're trying to convince him to let us work for him because he's going on this big expedition with the Defrog, and he's like, no. <laughs> like, okay, just go on Google Images and type in grumpy cat, and that's the kind of no that he's giving us. We can just show grumpy cat right now. Yeah, that. No. You <laughs> We're running from your bloody Templars. Oh my gosh. I know. This is why I hate him. Because he's looking out for his sister, but he's still like, I, don't, I know I can't help how you were born. You were just born this way, but you're making life harder on me. Yeah. And all I can think of is Uncle Gamblin. And then when it's your sister, your sister's just like, I don't want to be found out. I'm sorry that I'm doing this to you. And... If you're a nice character, then you're like, it's fine. Or else you just become your brother. Hey. Well, that wasn't obvious at all. What do you expect? Recognize this guy? He has an unhealthy attachment to his weapon. And by weapon, I mean his crossbow. You don't have the style to work high town with the merchants. 
Anyway. Now, did he create the crossbow? Because it's like not really a lot of crossbows in the game. But I think the dark spawn have crossbows. If you watch. Wait a minute. Does that mean that Varric is a dark spawn? No. Twist Dragon H3. I called it. I called it. Uh, all right. That's why he can't die because he's like a main boss in the in the next game. Sure. And if you're watching this and Dragon Age 3 is out, uh, just know that I freaking called it. Worthy! So I guess he knows you from the mercenaries? Yep. The Red Iron is what they're called. Okay, go, I get it. Go away, I can't see my mini map. Well, to be fair, you didn't actually know about crafting until the last time Shut you up. played it. <laughs> and that was like your ninth playthrough. Shut up. Who needs crafting? Sebastian. So this is a DLC that I guess, never mind. <laughs> yeah, Sebastian. I love his accent. Yeah. I have a thing for like European. Scottish and English. Just, I'm, I'm just like any other girl in the... States. <laughs> yeah. Long game. <laughs> well, it was too quiet. Well, we got this fan in the background, this, uh, our uh, heater, which sometimes works, sometimes it just makes it colder. Yeah, it kind of sucks. Why don't I just dub over your cursing with, like, stinks? I don't curse. Sucks is not a curse word. No, I'm just saying it would be funny. Like, if you said the F word, I'll just be like, friggin'. I do th not th that would be say my, the that F would be, word. That would be my bleep. Oh my just, gosh. I'm pondering. Alright, I whatever. can ponder if I want to. Alright. I can leave the old friends behind. Adelaide. Hello. What? Information is one of the key Wait, she looks a lot time. more intimidating now. Well, because she's in armor. I'm, yeah, the I'm saying... I, that's the whole point, that the, the design of the character was meant to be... to Otherwise, look intimidating. The seeker him. looked intimidating. Alright. Doesn't matter, though. I've been waiting for some... Uh, uh, the sun Maybe I'll actually go right ahead and do her quest right now. Yeah, the last time... You play, you just kind of did whatever you wanted. That's yeah. how I always play. <laughs> yeah, but now you have a... Well, I guess I'll goal. take this party. <laughs> <laughs> so, the map in, in this game doesn't seem as big as the first game. Because it isn't. And they like to reuse maps to just like close off certain paths. It's kind of annoying because they don't close them off on the mini-map, so you think that you can get somewhere by going mm -hmm. one way, but nope. There might be some stragglers before the main room. Nothing we can't handle. Oh, oh man. Stragglers. Haven't you already told me how to do combat? Well, now they're like assassins lurk on the edge of fight. Breaking... Oh! Hey, look, they run away. Yay. So Come on! <laughs> just move forward. Like, yeah, there you go. Really kind of reminds me of Kimo. He's like, short, and he shoots at like, Bolts or like darts. Leaves mushrooms everywhere. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Makes people run into them. I hate Teemo. What's over here? No. Let's explore, guys. Does it even the right way? Nope. That's Let's why I said, ah, there's people here. <laughs> what? <laughs> 
Well, I wasn't expecting that. This is very on the edge of the fight. Dealing with new fights together. I, mean, I guess more experience is good. <laughs> There's more of you. <laughs> there were these are the assassins. Yeah, look how it was hit with the axe. Oh, there's more people behind us. There must be in some kind of chest or something like that. I, I don't remember going this way before. Uh, so I guess there's a trap nearby. Yep. I want to switch to you. Yeah. Yep. yep. I don't see a trap. There wasn't even anything in that chest. Oh, they were the trap. Well, this is the worst game ever. <laughs> and now the trap goes off. <laughs> oh hey! Wow, there is stuff here. Oh fruit. Cool. Yeah, for crafting. Yeah. So, Good thing I did go this way. Yep. Now we fight. Can't see anything because that dialogue. Yeah, we have so much range. Evelyn, what are you doing? Evelyn, you have no range. Go up there. <laughs> this Evelyn is like the scariest thing in games. Hiding behind a mage? What kind of warrior are you? What kind of guard are you? Yeah. There's a target. Let me stay back here, guys. Oh, uh, no. The trap. No. But there's definitely a trap over there, I remember that. Whatever. Oh, what was that? Oh no, backstab your brother. Shut up. I'm trying to hit this archer. Yeah, the aiming is kind of... There's no lock on thing, but Oh Evelyn. <laughs> hey, look at that, she's trying to help uh Vera. Gavelin more. <laughs> That's okay, you have experience and I don't want to be kind of nice. Yeah, I'm not gonna use my brother once I can replace him with Fenris. Okay, keep talking about Fenris. Why don't you explain who Fenris is? He's this sexy, sexy elf with these lyrium tattoos with a sexy dark past with a sexy mysterious aura. Alright, bye guys! Bye guys, <laughs> next time we'll hear more about this sexy elf. <laughs> bye! Bye!